Hey YouTube, um, I'm going to be showing you guys today how to get Winterboard and how to change really my videos on how to customize your iPod um, 2G, this is the 2G and it is jailbroken, if you don't know how to jailbreak it I put my video link in the description on how to jailbreak it is the untethered version and so first what you want to do when you open up Cydia when you first open up Cydia, it's going to ask you for an internet connection, so do that. Then you're going to click on User Graphical, and then you should come up to this home page. What you need to do is go into Feature Packages, sorry, it's just reloading the data. Alright, so, yeah, if you go to changes, you should go to changes first. It says, I have an essential, essential upgrade, so I'm just going to do that. So I won't get any errors. I mean, these downloads take really quick, so just, it, you, it doesn't, it takes so, like, quick. It's not even funny. So just open it back up because you need to just close it and re like reboot it. Alright, so go back into changes and upgrade these two um, sources because if you don't, then you won't be able to download anything. So press confirm. It's downloading that. Okay, so that's done. Alright, so return to Cydia. And now, refresh. Refresh these so they're all brand new. And just, if you don't do this, Cydia is not going to be working well. Just, if you refresh and upgrade these things, Cydia will be working really good. So first what you want to do, as I said, go into Featured Packages, okay? Now go down, and then you see, hold on, let's go down, and then you see Winterboard right there. Oh, sorry, I went into the search bar. Go back into Featured Packages. Okay, so there's Winterboard. I did it again. So click on that winterboard custom look. Install it. Confirm. And then I'll download it. Now when it's done, it's going to ask you to reboot your device. Because it, every time that you change your background or anything it respring so press reboot and there there's the iPod touch 2g custom uh, boot logo that you get oh, sorry about that so there it is and just let come back okay so then you see winterboard right there it's like a snowflake logo and we don't sorry uh this came up but, all right so cancel the sink and we don't have anything inside of winterboard folder yet because we have not downloaded anything so go back into Cydia And go to search and 
say you want like a red theme, so type in red and search and then scroll down just anywhere. And let's see, what should I get? There's a lot of different ones. All right, so we'll go with, let's go to Saints Row. So Saints Row 2, and, inst and install that, confirm it. Downloading Saints Row 2. And when this is done downloading, it goes directly to Winterboard. Okay, now return to Cydia. Alright, now we're going to change the colors of the font. So type in font colors and install that before we go back into Winterboard because this also goes into Winterboard. This just changes the color of your font to red, blue, green. There's a bunch of colors. So return to Cydia and just let me go back to my home page. Go into Winterboard. And as you can see, you have the different fonts and the Saint Row 2. So what you need to do is click on Saints Row 2. And say you want a purple font. You drag it over Saint the, your theme and click onto it. Now press the home button and then it respring's as you can see there. Um, when it respring's, and there you go. There's the uh, Saints Row 2 theme, and the purple font, if you could see there. My camera isn't focusing, but it is the purple font, so... You can go back into Cydia and download as much as you um, as much themes as you want. And I hope this helped you. Rate, subscribe, and comment. And peace out.